Good Friday evening. I'm first of all, meteorologist Austin Evans. The weekend is here. Happy weekend. It's going to be very nice. It's also going to be very hot, and there's going to be things to do. I hope you're able to get out and enjoy this fine weekend we have in front of us. Heading out the door tomorrow, we're going to be seeing temperatures in the mid to upper 70s, uh, the low 80s probably in Shreveport. It's the same stuff tomorrow. Sunglasses, water, sunscreen, the KSLA First Alert weather app, so you can have updates on the go. Uh, but it is going to be a hot one tomorrow for the Red River Balloon. Balloon Rally, the second day of, and you can see here, heat advisory in place uh, across the entire Arklatex until 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. I expect this to get extended, um, but uh, we'll let you know if that does end up happening. Here's temperatures across the Arklatex. We're still in the 90s in Shreveport, Hempville Center, Nacogdoches, Longview, Texas, and Florine, Louisiana. 89 degrees in Mansfield, and you can see up north of I-30, Again, to Queen, Idabel, a bit cooler, along with Texarkana. They have been all afternoon. Still feels like 105 in Shreveport, 100 in Mansfield, as well as Hemphill and Florine, 102 for the heat index in Bedville. Now, we got a whole lot more hot days ahead of us, and uh, come Sunday, things may cool off slightly. Still going to feel like the triple digits, but uh, it is going to be a very hot stretch. And going into the week, our humidity is actually going to take a bit of a dive, but our measured temperatures are expected to rise. So we're not going to get a break from the heat. We're still going to be seeing triple digits in terms of feels like temperatures throughout most of this entire upcoming work week. And taking a look at rain chances, things stay slim to none. And in fact, Sunday, it's even lower than 30 for the most part. 97 for a high today, 79 for a low this morning. We actually did dip out of the 80s. Wouldn't you see, wh who would, wouldn't you know who won the pony? There it is. Uh, but uh, you can see here, above average on both ends of the spectrum. And there's our Mattress Plus KSLA Tower camera overlooking downtown Shreveport. A bit of cloud cover over downtown right now. Looking ahead to tomorrow evening, cool clothing. That's the big deal. And you're going to want to drink a lot of water, wear sunscreen, take breaks inside tomorrow at Louisiana Downs. It's going to be hot, and that's going to be the case through pretty much the entire event, even going into the later evening hours. Live First Alert Doppler Radar has got a shower moving through McCurtain County right now. Future Track is not picking up on, those, on that shower right now, but you can see here... Going into the overnight hours, we are going to see uh, the possibility of some showers just kind of working their way through, swinging through overnight. By 8 o'clock, it'll be pretty much gone. Sunshine going into the noon hour and throughout the entire afternoon. And if you're heading out to the Red River Balloon Rally, this is what you can expect for sky conditions, sunny skies, and then clear skies going into the evening. Looking ahead to your Sunday, there is a slight chance for some showers and storms, mainly scattered, and you can see a smattering of storms here and there throughout the afternoon. Feels like temperatures tomorrow likely to rise deep into the triple digits once again. That's why I expect that heat advisory to be extended uh, past 7 o'clock. And the first alert 7-day forecast showing the very hot week we have ahead of us. High pressure is setting up once again. Remember the last week of June, how warm it was uh, then? It's the same deal, same sort of setup that's bringing... A whole lot of dangerous heat once again to the Arklatex. I'm going to have the latest coming up on KSLA News 12 at 10. And then if you, and if you missed that in the morning on the website, uh, we will have an update there. And the weekend crew will be in charge for KSLA News 12 at 6 tomorrow evening. Uh, but I'll catch you at 10.